What is up guys and gals, Jonas Nifi here, and this is a review of another DC Collectibles Batman Arkham Origin. And today we're looking at the Batman's Arkham Origins DC Collectibles Killer Croc. Now this is a, a large figures. <clears throat> and this is second series two from the DC Collectibles Arkham Origins. So so here is Killer Croc. Now like I said I didn't show the package. It shows that they're a very large package. This one's blister cars. What we saw pictures. So so here is the out of package. Let's look at Killer Croc. In case you know, this version of Killer Croc is appears Arkham Origin. He was one of the first boss from Batman Arkham Origin, the game, where Batman strike out to stop White Mask before he gets by Killer Croc's showdown. And he also appears in the Arkham Silent of the goes after Jokers, and that was pretty much it. It was also a version, there is the Arkham Asylum Killer Croc, and there is also a layer from Arkham Knight that was the Killer Croc making him a cameo, making him a cameo, and it gets Pierce from the Joker's Hallucination flashback, and of course from DLC, which I'm not going to show the footage, that was a spoiler, which I'm not going to talk about spoilers. So here's Killer Croc figures, that's from Arkham Origins. Now let's take a look at the head sculpt. The head sculpt looks excellent. I think he did a good job how he looks captured from the video game. He looks pretty menacing. He looks darker looking. I do like he has the texturing shells, the gator shell skin. Looks texturing details. And yeah, that looks really fantastic look. I do like he has the pants. Pretty much that. He has the bare feet. He has the little toenails. Down hole, the rest of it. He has a little peg holes, and I do like he has a little hand skater. He has a wrap around his wrist. I do like he has a skin in the back. Looks pretty, looks sick. One is his butt. Also, there's a hole because apparently it, you suppose it has old rubbers. Apparently, you suppose it holds on, but apparently. That's my biggest problem. It feels loose. The peg starts to fall off easy loose. That's extremely careful. The biggest problem is is the feet. I don't understand it. For the size comparison, here's the next to the death stroke. He's a really size. He's twelve inches. He's a very 12 inch one. Now, Killer Croc does not come in any accessories. He does not come in any accessories or weapons. It's just a cross. Now, two questions. <laughs> and, oh, it also falls over. Articulation Killer Croc. He has the heads on ball joint. Goes left, right. It does go up and down that much. And you can see there's a scratch paint that was kind of accidentally. Try to stand it. There we go. Heads on the roof line. Goes up and down. This one just goes up and down. Goes in and out. He has a bicep swivel. Then the elbow. He has a wrist to rotate. It does hands movement. He does have ab articulation. It goes up and down. It does swivel waist movement. He has a swivel waist. His leg is forward and back. Goes in and out of that one side. And he does have bend and knee. And his ankle is side to side. And it has a peg holes on the bottom feet. So, yeah. So, there's my review. So, overall, this is pretty large. It's a pretty large figures. It's a pretty large figures. It's kind of large figures. It looks really nice looking. I mean, it looks better than the fireflies I did in my last review. 
So it's a nice looking figure. My only problem is is that the peg holes in the back you just fall out. I just got one. I got this one at Comic Con or Comic University. That was way back in 2014 year ago. So it's a very nice large figure. This was made by DZ Collectibles from 2014. So anyway, if you're a fan of the Arkham Origins series or the the Arkham series or the other Batman's Arkham characters, I guess you want to add your collections. So anyway, you hope you enjoyed this video. So don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe for more of the video reviews and toy reviews. And I hope you see you next video. And I hope you enjoyed this. So thanks for watching. Bye.